Alrighty then, hey there guys, and uh, welcome to session 6 of Let's Play Dead Space. Uh, I just finished recording session 5 a few minutes ago and whatnot, so yeah, let's get this started. Hydroponics log, Dr. Elizabeth Cross reporting. I'm pleased to say that we're working close to maximum capacity at the present time. Awesome. All flora is healthy and thriving, and food yield has created a surplus. Awesome. I was going to pass the surplus on to the colony. Awesome. The captain has given a no-fly order. Not awesome. I want to note my opposition to that order. Awesome. Everyone knows they're in trouble down there, and I don't see what denying them our surplus will achieve. Agreed. Well, gee, there's a crisis going on down there. What do you think we should do? I know, let's starve them. But no, that's actually a pretty good idea. And oh god, those little things. How I hate them so. So you know what? Screw it. I'm running away. I don't feel like deal dealing with that. Yeah, sorry if that just got really loud. I was kind of moving the microphone and while I was doing that. Hernandez the Game Mexican Octopus. Uh, the mic got pretty close to my mouth, so yeah, it might have been a little bit louder than how it's gonna be for the rest of the commentary. Yeah, sometimes the game just likes to screw with you like that, and just do like these, uh, random things where it's like really loud noises, and you're like, oh my god, that's a rock and roll. But really, it's not. That reminds me. Sound test. Well, not sound test, sync test, blah, 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 whatever. Hell, hey, look, there's Hammond. How you doing, Hammond? You doing good? Isaac. Good to see you in one piece. Same to you. Don't take your helmet off. Okay. The head's rotten. Kind of figured. I gotta look at it. At what? It's huge. You oh, that Leviathan thing? Shut it oh, yeah, the Leviathan to push over. No, no need to worry about that crew that was on this deck I think they're what's poisoning the air jerks they've been transformed I saw one of them bloated swollen the poison factories we need to take them out where we can still breathe Hammond I thought you were Wait. dead you need to get to cleaner air you're not going to be able to help Isaac in your condition Isaac I'm scanning the area now He's right, there's something really big in food storage. Really big? As in, like, the brute scan. big? Monitor readings are off the scale. Be careful. Oh yeah, gee, what lovely advice. Be careful. That's almost as good advice as Hammond gave me for when I first ran into the brute. Thank you, Hammond. I'll kill it with the information you've given me. It's big. Really big. What invaluable information. Door to food storage, but I can't override the integrity lockdown. You have to destroy the pods to bring the air quality up. Then you can go through and use the poison on the Leviathan. Uh, so you, so you, so you, so you. I don't know why it's giving me ammo for guns I don't even have. Right, I don't have anything in the safe. Uh, nah, I, I won't buy anything right now. I'll wait until uh, later. Do 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 do. What's in here? Murders. I suppose I should be glad that Ham's alive, but I still don't trust him. Why not? He's hiding something about the marker. Why do you think that? And besides, even if he did know something about the marker, why would he hide it in this situation? I mean, it kind of seems like a situation in which he didn't, if he didn't tell us everything, we'd all die anyway, so, uh, yeah. Besides, I like him better than I like you. He at least does stuff. He just sit there and tell me to go do stuff and whatnot. Like, oh, Isaac, I found a poison that can help you kill whatever's uh, blah, 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 
poisoning the air. It's like, oh my god, Kendra, you actually did something. But no, no, she just told me to go pick up some stuff and then mix it myself. So once again, she didn't really do anything other than tell me to go do stuff. Uh, yeah, and this, like, very first part there, like, crap loads of necromorphs here, so, uh, Gotta be on your toes, and oh god, it's behind me! Surprise, Bart Shack! No! That is the worst kind! Once again, giving me ammo for guns I don't even have. Alright, where'd that baby go? There it is. You see, there are even more necromorphs. See, look, there are even more! How is that baby not dead? How many times have they shot it now? Look, there are even more Necromorphs. Look, even more Necromorphs. Holy crap! Yeah, there's a lot. Uh. Did anyone else just hear that? It was like. Yeah. Alright, from what I remember, there's like a large med pack in there, so do that, stasis it, run around quickly, and, uh, yep, there it is. Awesome. Uh, do 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 do. I'll use a medium. And oh crap, I'm running low on ammo. No, 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 no. Alright, so yeah, whenever you enter, like, the near vicinity of, uh, one of these things, it'll basically treat it as if you were in a vacuum. Basically, you have a limited amount of time to kill these things. Oh, yeah, by the way, you don't have to expend any ammo to kill them. All it takes is just a couple of stomps, and then they're done. Oh, yeah, watch out, because I think after you kill them, it spawns more necromorphs in here. Yep. Even more necromorphs. Let's see, that's what? Necromorph number 50 in this room already? Alright. I know he's not faking because he dropped something. Bring it on, baby! Bring it on! And more gun, or more ammo for weapons I don't have. Alright, so. Here. All right, so there's one in here. Yeah. Two stops. No, oh, this one takes three. What am I? And look, even more necromorphs. Uh, yeah, for these guys, just go ahead and just try to hit them in the arms. They like, don't even bother going for the legs. The legs are really stumpy. So you'll have a higher chance of like hitting them in the stomach, and trust me, you do not want to hit these guys in the stomach. Gosh dang it, delim him already! I shot his arm like 15 times. But yeah, that is the one thing that I'm really gonna miss about not using the force gun. It's that uh, those little things, like those little tiny. Slimy. I don't even know what those are. But they jump on you and you tap A to like insta kill them and whatnot. And yada yada yada. But yeah, those things, they suck. And like the force gun, you can take out an entire pack of them in just like one shot. See, I'm, I'm really gonna miss not using the force gun. Most likely just because of that. Monies. Uh, yeah, when you see a collection of bodies like this, just go ahead and stop on them. Shut up, Nicole. Because uh, usually when they just have a collection of bodies like this and there are like no necromorphs, well, except for that thing, when there are like no dangerous necromorphs, like ones that'll kill you and all that kind of stuff, that usually means 
They're gonna put those bad things in the room soon, which will turn all the necromorphs and then turn all the dead bodies into necromorphs. And it'd just be more of a hassle for you. So, uh Yep, everything's good. A couple of stomps. And there they are. And see, now that they don't have any bodies that they can use, they're gonna try to kill me. But they fail miserably. Sucks that they didn't drop anything, though. Could have really. Oh, hey, look, there's stuff in here. Ammers! Wait, how much ammo do I have now? Oh my god. This is bad. This is really bad. Yeah, pretty soon I'm gonna have to restock on ammo because I'm nearly out. I only have like 36 shots left. Alright, more ammo. Uh, let me just check to see what's in here. Um, uh, okay. What? Usually it takes it out of like... It shook our neck. Hey, you like that, huh? Huh? Alright. Now pick up that... No! Freaking crap. Boom! Boom! Oh. Oh. What the heck did that guy's body just do? Do you see that? That is weird. Why does Kinesis always pick up the crap that I don't want? Like, oh, hey, look, there's something shiny over there. Maybe it's an item that I can pick up. Oh, do you want to pick up this necromorph's head? No. His leg? No. His arm? No. His T Rex stubby arm? No. Uh, freaking babies. Uh, from what I remember, like the technical term for these guys are lurkers. But I think babies. I think calling them babies is better. So I can do that. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back. I want my baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back, baby back. Yeah. Jump through there. Alright, why don't you drop Ripper Blades? I thought I could sell those. Exiting zero gravity. Oh yeah, I remember this thing. Hello? Hello, security? Thank God. This is Dr. Croft in hydroponics. I'm trying to locate second engineer Jacob Temple. I can't get through to engineering. Of course I know there's a shipwide medical alert. That's why I'm trying to locate him. No, we're safe for now, but the tram is down and we can't reach the escape pod. Hello? Hello? An inventory full? What the frick? Whatever. I'll use the first aid. Bring that up in there. I'm just gonna. Alright. Now wait for that to open. Shoot that. Because I really don't want to get burned in this situation. Up. Smack 
that guy to stumble him. Because he melee has its uses, even against like those Necromorphs. 